Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. I'm back today with a quick haul from a local scrapbook store. It's called Sassy Scrappers, and it's sassyscrappers.com. It's in the hill country of Texas, and I try not to go in there very often, but I had a um, had um, some credit or like bonus dollars in there or whatever, so I was able to get a good amount off, so it was worth the trip. Um, it's, it's a fun scrapbook store. It's privately owned, and um, I met the owners before they opened, and they were super, she was super, super nice, and um, anyways, I went by there the other day and absolutely enjoyed my time there. So, the first thing I want to share is I picked up some of the, um, and I cannot read that writing, let me see, Dream Weaver Stencils. This is who it's manufactured by, Stampers Anonymous. And it is um, crackle texture paste. So Studio 490, and I can't. It, Wendy, I should know that. I don't. I, don't, I can't read it. Beach or something like that. Um, peach, beach. <laughs> Anyways, I'm um, just crackle texture paste. I'm gonna use this in some mixed media, so I will enjoy that. And I saw some of this. this is called texture powder. Add paint, create dimension. So I'm really excited to play with this. This is by Art O, and it is a my art com and um, that's who seems to make it so super super cute really really like this um, I'm not sure that you couldn't do this yourself with even sand and stuff but I'm sure there's a reason why this is um, the way it is but anyway so I thought that was super neat I'm going to try with those, uh, play with those two in some mixed media and I picked up this um, beautiful stamp it's by Arts Z Dare to be clear stamps, and it's dare to be artsy.com. And I love this, it has scripture and it's a lighthouse, which is one day when we hopefully get to open up our business. Whoops, it will be um, lighthouses, the, um, the logo. So I love that, it's really beautiful. Um, it reminds me of some of the lighthouses on the east coast. Let your light shine, be still. God's love will lead me through, and I will use this in some of my Bible journaling. The Lord will guide you always, Isaiah 58, 11. I love that. Your word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path, Psalms 119, 105. Love that. Love, love, love this. This is such a darling stamp set. Okay, and then um, I just did a paper haul from um, Cherry on Top, and there were some cooking things that I bought this with that in mind, and there's some other cute other cooking things. So this is Clear Stamps, Kaiser Craft. Love them. And here's the definition of kitchen, a gathering place for friends and family, a place where memories are homemade and seasoned with love. That is so cute. That'd be cute in a recipe book. Um, people who love to eat are always the best people. <laughs> That's cute. Cook the Scrabble letters. Bon Appetit. That reminds me of Julia Childs. Homemade. Um, happiness is spending time cooking fabulous food for friends. And live life with a little spice. Super cute. Love that. Okay. Um, I bought that. Obviously had a cooking thing on my mind. I love this. Wouldn't you love to have a mixer that's pink with all that bling on it? I mean, seriously. I know. I'm such a girl. I really like girly stuff. So, super, super cute. Um, so, let's see what else I have here. Oh, this is the die, pardon me, that goes to that lighthouse. So, there's the kit. Love that. And that one is My Path, Dare to Be, and then this one is Lighthouse, the, the die cut. So, the die. Okay, so here's the ephemera, Summer Dreams, I love this. As a kid, we always spent summers in this town because my, my family always had an extra, um, you know, condo type house there. And um, I just remember really fun summers there. And so when I saw this, when I'm over there, I just always think of summer. Um, anyway, so vacation, I mean, it's really cute ephemera, um, the flamingo, just really pretty and bright, cheerful colors, and, I mean, literally, you could put that in a card and put a sentiment across that, stamp it, it'd be a darling, it'd be a really cute, you know, the little, um, the mopeds, what are those called? Anyways, um, just super, super cute stuff. There's so much you can do with ephemera, and I'm going to be doing a, a series of cards with ephemera. So here's another ephemera pack. Um, so this one, they're both the same. I wonder if I knew that I had done that. 
Yep, they're exactly 33 pieces, Summer Fun, Echo Park Ephemera, super cute, and yep, that is darling. I, nope, they are different. I did, I did, I thought I had looked at the backs, so they must be from the same line, but aren't those cute? Oh, really? And I love the colors. I love that watermelon tag. That is so cute. I've got a darling card to do for my dad for his birthday that's watermelon. I may do something with that tag. I'm not sure yet. Oh, look at that. Sweet summertime. That's awfully cute. Oh, I got this because this is Texas State University Bobcats. My husband went to grad school there. Our son graduated from there. Our daughter -in graduated from here. And it's really hard. This Texana Designs, she has since retired, so it's really hard to find her stuff. And this particular store went around Texas and bought up almost all the inventory. So every time I'm in town, I try to pick them up. They're very inexpensive, $4.50. And anything Texas State, never can you find anything Texas State. So, um, anyways, <laughs> so I, I thought they're great stamps. I love all those stamps. Um, card making for connoisseurs die cuts. And this is fundamentals. Huh. So, thanks so much. Oh, that's cute. That make a darling card. A quick and easy card. Ephemera is great for quick and easy cards. Oh, this is cute. It has thank you. A cup of kindness. Thank you. Thinking of you. Thinking of you. Congratulations. Thanks so much. Really cute. Love that. And then there's some blank ones that you could stamp on. Super, super cute. Love that. Oh, this is cute. Okay, this is Inkadu. It's one of those ones that comes with its own little acrylic block, which I'll just throw in here. But I really love, this says thanks, hello, hooray, darling, darling banners. I think those are cute. And those would be Darling, unlike um, you know, a bright, rich cardstock with um, a solid embossing, it would just—I mean, you could think of a million things. You could hand color each one of those, and then huff on the back of the stamp, and then print it with all different colors across it. I mean, there's a million different ways you could do this. So super, super, super cute. Love this. Oh my goodness, these are so cute. Okay, I love this. I love fall. Um, we lived in New England one year, and fall in New England, especially Maine, was absolutely breathtaking. And um, for Thanksgiving, the year we lived there, we took our kids to Plymouth Plantation and took them to one of the big feasts that they have where everybody's dressed in um, the era, and they're telling stories, and they're talking to you in, you know, in character. And it was literally like an eight or nine course meal, and we were sick as dogs, but we had the best time. We spent the whole weekend taking the kids back and forth to that and to other things in Plymouth. Um, we really loved Plymouth. It's a really beautiful little little town. Um, Cranberry Museum, uh, Ocean Spray is there. Really fun. So I love that. That is really cute. That's what it reminds me of. Now this is a really cute Bow Bunny ephemera kit. I wish there were more of these. I find these a lot, um, not Bo Bunny, but other other versions of it, with um, uh, at Tuesday morning. And I really love things like this because it's like, here's here's this amount of stuff, make something beautiful. And it, it kind of reminds me of like those cooking shows, you know. Anyways, but um, I like those kind of challenges where you have this much stuff, make something beautiful. So, oh, and it comes with, huh. I don't know if it comes with, I, I don't know. It's called Enchanted Harvest Ephemera. And I guess it comes with instructions. Hmm. We'll see. That's really neat. I really, and I love the cards in there. Isn't that cute? Oh, seriously. That's one that's going to stay on the table. Look at these. I love the Bunny Ephemera. It is gorgeous. And this is absolutely gorgeous. I think I bought some paper at, um, chair on the hill that we go with this. I'll have to double check. But I mean, like I bought a couple of sheets, but this is beautiful and I could see lots and lots of beautiful cards and mixed media. Um, oh yeah, really beautiful. And scrapbooking. There's so much you can do with ephemera, tags, etc. There's so much you can do. Mini albums. Oh gosh, look at all that comes in that. This has 45 pieces and they are gorgeous. I wish I would have bought two. It was only $4.99. Isn't that crazy? It's so beautiful and so rich in color. Okay, you can tell what I like. What I really like is in this shop, 
they took the time to wrap the paper. I'm kind of a paper snob, and I don't like it um, damaged. So I really like it when people take the time and wrap it. And, um, or, you know, put it with card cardstock or something with it, you know, cardboard, keeping it from getting damaged. So, and I love that purple bag. You know, I'll cut that up and use it for something. <laughs> but anyways, all right, this is a, a big stack of paper. So I am going to go quickly. I will not go as slow as I did on... Um, cherry on top. So, all right, authentic. Absolutely love authentic. Oh, love that for Christmas. Um, let me see here. Okay, I have two of those. Beautiful. And let me move that. I don't want that to get run. Okay. Oh, the stickers. That's right. This was all clearance. This. Can you believe? I found all of these authentic. This two. These two pieces of paper. All of these stickers were all in their clearance bin. Seriously, isn't that a score? I mean, how many of these are there? One, two, three, four, five, six. Can you believe that? And yes, I picked up every single one because they were dirt cheap. And this is Retro Christmas. I love this. Authentic. Uh, Santa's almost here. Oh, darling, this is a, as merry as I get. <laughs> That's cute. Hip Hip Parades, Christmas Day. Dear Santa, don't let the tinsel... It, don't get your tinsel on a tangle. Best holiday ever. Believe, toys, enjoy. Merry Christmas. Oh, I love that. That reminds me of when I was a little girl. That is so cute. At Christmas, play and good play and make good cheer for Christmas comes but once a year. Thomas Tusser. I love the cheers. Um, another day of outward smiles and inward screams. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, sorry, that was a little um, sad, but really cute. Have you been naughty or nice? Merry Christmas to all. Best time of the year. Unwrap the magic. Um, a thrill of hope. Of, weir of weary world rejoices. Super cute. Unwrap the magic. Oh, by golly. That is so cute. It's a wonderful life, love. Christmas morning favorite. Ho, ho, ho. Let's be jolly. Oh, look at the tabs. This would make a darling, darling um, mini albums for Christmas. I have six of these. Shh, don't tell. That's the way I think I'm going to do it. And I love that little bitty deer. Isn't that sweet? Okay, absolutely charming. Um, that's going to be mini albums, I think. Yes, so super cute. Um, and I will take you along for the ride and cheer. Um, boy, I just, I have a long list of things I want to do for Christmas this year. I hope I get them done. Um, this is by Bo Bunny, Beautiful Dreamer, and isn't that pretty? I really love that. That's really pretty, and I love this. Isn't that pretty? Let me make sure these are all, no, they're not the same. So, let's start with this one. Let me make sure, yeah, these are all the same. So, there's the back on this one, Beautiful Dreamer, and it's beautiful, yeah, Beautiful Dreamer, and then look at this, I love this. And so the adventure begins. I love all these. I mean, these would make darling cards. And these are darling journaling spots. Or if you have the stickers for this kit, you could raise those up on Pop Dots and put them on top of there and put that on the front of a card. Oh, seriously. Cute, 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 cute. Okay, love that. And this is also Bo Bunny. Oh, I love that. The car dash. I know I didn't see that. And I love the map. And then I got this because our son was a major chess player as well as our youngest daughter, but mainly our son. And um, he was really ranked um, very well at 18 years old uh, or under 18 in the nation. It was a real amazing thing to see. And um, for a young man who had struggled with learning disabilities, this was such a blessing for him, and it helped so much in his development as far as his mental acuity and just all of that, you know, brain builders. So chess has been a big part of our life. Games we love, and I love that vintage car. <clears throat> super, super cute Discover. Oh, my goodness. This is darling paper. Now I wish I would have had two. Oh, so I have to go back. No, I can't go back. <laughs> it's like a... It's addicting. <laughs> okay, so this, oh, this is that paper series that I love. It's called Cherish. Heartland, Sweet on You, um, Blue, Fern, Blue Fern Studios, yeah. I love this. I want to think, is this UK? No, China. This one's made in China. I love this. I love, love, love this. So I would totally cut that out and use that and that and that. 
and I love that wreath. Gorgeous, cherished verb to hold or treat as dear, feel loved for, to care for, tenderly to nurture, to cherish a child. Cherish sweet on you. I love that. That's gorgeous. Isn't that pretty too? Mm. Okay, so this is a paper line that I see every time I go in there and I pick up a little bit each time. So I love this. The bicycle built for two. Um, wow, I love that. I would totally mix media with this or scrapbook. Love this. And I love the back of this as well. And I love that strip that I would use. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my goodness. Okay, so love that. Mixed media, that's what it screams to me, card making. Love that strip. It's gorgeous. I love that paper. And it tells me this is going to be absolutely breathtaking. And it is. Absolutely adore this. I think this is gorgeous. Heartland, again, Blue Fern St Studios. Okay, I was good. That's all I got of that. And by the way, this cardstock is heavy. This is heavy cardstock. This would be great for albums. This would be this would be great for mini albums, cards. This would be great for mixed media. It's it's got such a heavy um, weight to it. Really, really good stuff. All right, so here's some bow bunny, and it's not all the same. So let me make sure I unstack some of it. So okay, here's this. It's Winter Wishes by Bow Bunny. And I love the colors of this. It's really distressed. I love that. I mean, you could cut that up and use it as borders or, I mean, all kinds of things. And that's why I bought it. I knew that was coming. I love these. These are so charming. <gasps> Aren't those great? And, like, even on these partials, you could cut these out and use these on cards, the full ones. But you could use these partials all over in mixed media. Don't throw those away. There's always a place to use these things. Um, on the edge of your um, your page, etc. Uh, I'll do some mixed media pages with these. Um, I, I hate to share my mixed media um, journal. I don't think I'm anywhere near as good as anybody else, and but I've got some new ones I'm going to start. So I may do one just based off journaling cards and see what I can figure out with them. But anyways, isn't that beautiful? Look at the the wolf with the deer antlers. That's so cute. I love that, and I love that. Uh, gorgeous to my heart, the key to my heart. Uh, that's just my life, cutting with scissors. There are scissors everywhere in this house. My husband was like, where are the scissors? <laughs> so, isn't that beautiful? The night sky, the winter night sky, beautiful. Okay, so this is bright and cheerful. Okay, I know exactly what this is. This is Graphic 45, and I wanted this paper before, but I wanted to see it in person. And because I'm not a really yellow orange gal and this just really it just reminds me of the 70s but it has that blue in there there's something about this that's enchanting it's just enchanting and this is the um, trying nature sketchbook collection I this is the one paper pad right now I don't have but that's why I wanted it isn't that gorgeous I love these journaling cards I've seen these they are just gorgeous, and I wanted to see them in real life to see if the colors, what they really were, and would I be able to work with those colors, and of course I could, it's Graphic 45. Everything Graphic 45 is just gorgeous. So I wanted to see, yeah, no strips on the top, so. All right, really cute. I mean, I could just, that just screams mini album to me, but, and I have one, two, three, I picked up three of those super excited to play with that. That is going to stick out because that's going to be um, kind of a fall project. So here's all the ladybugs. And for those of you who don't know, our youngest daughter is from China. In China adoption, um, the, the not logo, but the mascot is the ladybug. So um, she's our ladybug and I love these. This is, that screams cards to me. Super, super, super cute. This reminds me a lot of like Beatrix Potter and that um, that era in the late 1800s, I believe it was late 1800s, where the children were taught um, to draw and to literally sketch nature, and it was just an amazing time. And she was an amazing author as well as um, artist. Okay, we are not done with this yet. Oh my gosh. So here's this side. Isn't that gorgeous, that blue and teal? That is just breathtaking. And then, I know I kind of revealed it a little early there, look at the border strips. Okay, I love all of these. Isn't this gorgeous? 
seriously I mean I see cards with this I just see lots of stuff every time I look at these I see different things but I say the same things to y'all but I wish you could see inside my mind because I I just see um, you know paint and oh just all kinds of you know just amazing like embellishments and all that will go with this so really really charming absolutely charming graphic 45 never disappoints I mean never with a big end so I love this this is like um, you know where you're practicing drawing nature sketchbook that's the name of this paper so I love the colors here I love the cream on top of distressed turquoise and you know navy really beautiful and that is breathtaking my youngest loves butterflies so you know who this is going to be for she loves butterflies here in Texas I've shared before we have the butterflies migrate south in the fall so literally you'll just have you know swarms of butterflies come through at times and um, it's been a while since I've seen that but I love now where they all come and you know they light on all the beautiful flowers that we have and um, we have a lot of flowers on our property and so um, they love the blooms and there's certain things that are for butterfly gardens that attract them more so anyways gorgeous gorgeous I love that and whoops I got everything tipping over there because I'm trying to make two different stacks on already a lot of stacks so that is beautiful um, the world is but a canvas to our imagination that's really lovely I love this I love the bird's eggs oh, beautiful just and the bird feather of course, all the butterflies, the flo the flowers, just beautiful. So the other side, ooh, that's kind of fun. Not my favorite color, but no matter what, Graphic 45 does a phenomenal job, and it's gorgeous. There's no getting around it. Really beautiful. Okay, that's it for my Graphic 45 portion. So we're almost through this, guys. I will try to hurry it up. Okay, so now, let me see how many of us. I have several, so... Oh. Isn't that cute? So this is all um, Kaiser Craft. Their paper is very affordable in this shop. So that's why I let myself do this. And like I said, I had extra, you know, freebie bucks to spend. So I had a great time. I do love nothing in the world so well as you, Shakespeare. True friends are the greatest of blessings. I love that. Enjoy your day. Love always. Thank you. Happy birthday. Love lots and live well. Best wishes. Hello. Lovely. Thank you. Thinking of you. A friend is what the heart needs at all times. Henry Van Dyke. Beautiful. And look at the clouds on the back. And there's that strip again. Way to go, Kaiser Crafts. I love this. So beautiful. Okay, so I'm going to put that down there. And then here is, um, this says, this is from the Dalai Lama. The purpose of our lives is to be happy. So, isn't that beautiful? The cherry blossoms. So beautiful. Which, cherry blossoms are Japanese. Dalai Lama, Chinese? Anyways. Okay, to live is the rarest thing in the world. Most people just exist. Oscar Wilde. Huh, not true. A smile happens in a flash, but the memory will last a lifetime. Happiness is sharing your life with the ones you love. Um, explore, discover, love, dream, explore, discover. Together is a beautiful place to be. Every picture tells a story of the pagodas. They are beautiful in China. Be your own kind of beautiful. Find your happy moment. You are my sunshine, my moon, and all my stars. E.E. E. Cummings. So this is Kaiser Craft Hanami Garden Collection. Hoshi. So really beautiful. Just like I said, this, this store has a lot of fun and amazing stuff. So I love the Texas print. Gotta love that. Sorry. <laughs> Texas girl. And that looks like a watercolor of the blue bonnets in the Texas Hill Country. I love that. And this was a two-part. And um, these are um, scrapbook, scrapbook customs. So, and this was Stamping Station, the Texas one. Stamping Station. So, these are definitely local Texas, but really beautiful. Okay. Okay, let's see. Not much more, guys. We're almost through. And this was like it's all, yep, it's all authentic. So this is the new authentic Fast 10 two-sided paper, Fast Time 10 two-sided paper. It's not down in any map. True places never are. It is not down in any map. True places never are. Herman Melville. Interesting. Sorry I read that uh, wrong. 
Um, smile pretty, say cheese, watch the birdie. Super cute. Vintage cameras. Love that. So the other side is, oh, this is why I bought it. This is what I love. Oh, whoops, wait a minute. The other side is that. Love the vintage cameras. So here is this. Oh, I love this. I absolutely love this old, um, like, advertisements and magazines and newspapers and super cute. Pastime 8 paper. Again, authentique and, yeah, super cute. Oh, love that. I love the campers. Okay, I love all the little campers. Let's just, let's see which one look like ours. Well, it's kind of between a couple of them, but anyways, it's not really on here, but yeah, we had a pull, little pull trailer, and it says, it's not down, okay, I already read that, by Herman Melville. Okay, so this is cute. I love Route 66. Um, we have definitely driven it. Um, I love it. We've caught it from Texas all the way to California. It's really a fun drive. Um, so New Mexico, Illinois, California, Oklahoma, Arizona, Missouri, Texas. Love that. Love it, love it, love it. And I love all the vintage um, paper and maps and newspapers behind it and ads. And I love the travel itinerary. Super, super cute. Super cute. And look there, it says traveler's names, trip start date, and number of travelers, number of pets, duration days. Super cute. Oh my goodness. Super, super cute. Let me go back and show you something. So, this is vintage so you're thinking it's like old-fashioned. And then all of a sudden you look down here and it says um, emergency contacts, name, home phone, cell phone, address, relationship notes. Um, cell phone? I love that. Authentique is, they really do some fun stuff. I absolutely love this. And I looks like I picked up two and I'm glad I did. So whenever we are together, that is home. I love that. Travel log, place and date. I don't need therapy. I just need a vacation. Exactly. Right now I really need that. Drive, eat, sleep. Um, and a vacation where you just go sit on the beach and sleep. I would love that kind of vacation. Maybe get a little massage-y. Um, <laughs> a massage. Anyways, but I don't know. Life is, you know, I I would love to go to a spa somewhere. Wouldn't that be fun? It would be just so fun. Um, anyways, life is a grand adventure. Go live it. Our, on, our, uh, on our way, paid in full. Um, going places. Let's camp out under the stars. Good eats. Um, our road trip. Super cute. This will make a darling, darling, darling um, mini album to give to somebody who's getting ready to go on a trip. Super cute. Or they went on a trip and they can go back in and fill it out afterwards. I've done those as well. Um, make, you know, mini albums for people. So, all right, this is Bo Bunny. Bo Bunny's Back to Backs. Felicity. So, I love that. Isn't that beautiful? And, yes, I would cut this apart. Super pretty. I love the pearls, and I love the old-fashioned shoes. Vintage. Love it, love it, love it. Ooh, I those pretty roses. Very pretty. Okay, I can see where this was in the store. Um, love this. Beautiful cut apart. It's very beautiful. Or you could do it, you know, a mixed-media page and with pictures or treasures from your trip and put in a scrapbook album, however you would want to do it. Oh, I love that too. That's beautiful. I love that those colors are so light and yet they have, they actually have color. It's not just a wash. So pretty. Okay. I think we're at the end, guys. That's the last one. Okay. So that is really neat. A map. I'm trying to see where it is. I'm not really sure where this is a map of. There's, I love that edge for the cards, playing cards. Oh, this is the gentleman paper. This is by Kaiser Craft, Barbershop Collection, and I really love all these cut aparts. These would make darling men's cards. Make a darling album for your son, for your brother, for your nephew, for your dad. Super cute. You could just do all kinds of stuff with that. Um, I purposely bought only two. I didn't buy the whole line. And the reason why is I'm going to use this for some quickie cards. So, all right, guys, that is it. This is an amazing haul from a local scrapbook mom and pop shop. Um, again, I would just really encourage y'all that if you have these, 